Hey guys, Miss Graham here. I have a special story for you today called La Princesa and the Pea. Now this is your The Princess and the Pea story, only it's going to be half in English and half in Spanish. La Princesa and the Pea. Written by Susan Middleton Elia, illustrated by Juana Martinez Neal. And it says, the queen has a trick up her sleeve, but el principe just might have one of his own. There once was a prince who wanted a wife, but not any niña would do in his life. His madre was picky. She hoped for perfection. The prince was so lonely in need of affection. But here came a maiden en route to her castle. I hope I can stay here if it's not a hassle. She winked at the prince who fell for her fast. No matter what mom does, I'll marry this lass. The prince said, come in, but his mother, La Rena, decided to test her. Would this girl be buena? Mama sneaked away to the royal jardin and found a small pea that was fit for a queen. She guarded the pea pod and took to the stair. If this girl is worthy, she'll feel that it's there. She placed El Guisante in the bed for their guest. She yelled, Veinte mattresses! Lofty request. The queen settled in with her box of bombones, while lots of strong workers came in with colchones. Uno was suave, dos was pequeño, tres was muy grande, cuatro Un sueño. Several, several were pinstriped, some made of fleece, others were dotted or checkered or grease. The queen ate her treats, the bed was stacked high, and right when they finished, la niña came by. Here is your cama, a place you can sleep. Thanks, said the girl. I won't even count sheep. Meanwhile, el principe practiced I do's. He knew that his maiden was the one he should choose. I like her, mama, he said with a lilt. We'll see, said the queen as she fluffed up his quilt. The girl stretched her brazos and ooh, yawned with her boca, but she felt but the bed felt so lumpy like there was a roca. The little guisante, twenty times deep, could it be the reason the girl got no sleep? She trudged down to breakfast, her ojo so droopy. How was your slumber? La Reina was Snoopy. Great, said the girl, if you like hard and lumpy. Oh, pobrecita, the prince said, you're grumpy. Their guest brightened up as she noticed the lad. Really, she murmured, it wasn't that bad. I thought La Reina, how'd she detect it? Is she a real princess? I think I suspect it. She signaled her son that the girl passed the test. Drat, she had managed to save off the rest. The prince soon proposed with a golden anillo. They married that week in the royal castillo. The queen kept her promise and threw a big boda. The bride wore a wedding gown, stylish de moda. Acepto, acepto, they both said I do. And still to this day, the queen has no clue. 
the prince had put pitchforks and stones in La Cama to help his true love pass the test of Queen Mama. The prince and his bride had hijos galore, each one, one for each mattress, and then had no more. El fin. The end. Hope you guys enjoyed the story. Miss you guys.